Yo, good morning. It's Monday, uh, early. I got up at like 3 o'clock in the morning. I haven't been able to go to sleep, so I'm not screwing around. Uh, it was kind of a nice, easy weekend. Didn't really do much. Uh, I didn't. All my friends, all my people that helped me uh, took the weekend off to do family stuff like they should <laughs> instead of over here helping me all the time. But, um, yeah, I uh, still, I made, I fabbed up a bracket for my spare tire mount that I'm sticking on the side of the trailer. Um, I recently had somebody donate some money. Uh, one of my people that watch my videos, um, doesn't really want, I, I'm sure they don't want me to say their name, but thank you very much. I appreciate it. Um, I bought a bunch of things and I've got lots of stuff all around. I got to put in, uh, the trailer and the bus. I'm supposed to be doing my countertops this weekend. Uh, Gaylord's supposed to help me and Mike, uh, Sunday, I think we're doing that. But, um, it's, it's getting picked up and moving a little bit faster than it was there the past year, but it's me dragging my feet and not knowing what I'm doing. And this medicine, I'm on this medicine, uh, it kind of clouds my mind, I think, that gabapentin, and there's all that stuff out and commercials about it, and I take it. But it's the only thing that helps with my phantom pains. I get phantom pains so bad, it's awful. And I tried getting off of it once because I know how it is, and I didn't withdraw from it or anything the way I weaned off of it, but my phantom pains were awful. I mean, your stumps, that dumbass thing there, and this, all my knee on this, like my left leg, my knee, and my ankle, and my shin, and my toes will all ache, tingle, feel like I drop something on them constantly, and the right one, this is the worst, and honestly... I should have probably had this one above the knee because I had 11 surgeries in two and a half months. And this one here has a lot of scar. It's all dead scar tissue underneath there. It's I got to worry about messing it up all the time to where eventually I'm probably going to end up getting it cut off above the knee. I can just see it coming. But I got it healed up now. It's still uh, got a scab here, but it's not like it was. I still got to wrap it every couple days for a couple days to keep the swelling down so I can still wear my prosthetic my prosthetic so I can drive but I've got a lot going on out here this weekend myself um I got my solar panel kit that's for the trailer that way Candace can have power to change her clothes and do whatever she's got to do in her tack shop when she's using as a tack shop at her horse shows um that's to hang stuff in the trailer I've got miscellaneous tools and different D hooks, D rings, and things I've got, small ones. I've got bigger ones somewhere. Um, just stupid stuff I've bought that I use, I'm gonna use in the trailer. That is my aluminum uh, mount I bought at Majestic for my trailer to mount the spare tire on. And I had to do some customizing to make it work because it just came with something that slides up and down in there and a stud and then a wing bolt. That's it. it. Didn't have a bracket to go over the rim to hold it on there. Um, so I mean, I customized the piece of metal I had. I had this bracket, or this piece here. These two were on it, something, and I cut the metal out. And used that to make what I made. I dropped it off my neighbor Bob in the back, Bob Latham. He's got, he's my buddy, older guy in the back that helps me out. And, uh, really got me believing I could do this. And... Help me get to kind of where I'm at in a way as far as believing I could do it. But anyway, he's back there machining that up. He's gonna. I had to change it from a half inch to three quarter inch uh, all thread. That way I could fit my lock through it. I mean, if somebody wants to steal it, they can steal it. But at the trailer place where they sell spare tires, they sell more spare tires for people getting them stolen than they do flat tires. So I'm gonna make it as you know, hard as I can for them to just take it. Yes, that's red. Yes, it's bright. But one of the other things I bought was beauty rings and center caps. Never thought of it to ask, but I wanted chrome, and I, I didn't even see pictures of them. I just asked the guy at the counter. He's like, looked on, on his uh, thing, said, yeah, I can have them for you next Wednesday. So I bought them, and I'm hoping they're chrome, and hoping the center caps are decent. But I changed it to red because they were gray, and I could not stand it. Um, my bus has the chrome on the front and rear tire, you know, the rims, uh, they look good. I like that look. The gray wasn't having it. I just couldn't get it. Um, I've got three or four foot LEDs to go in the trailer, uh, straight down the back, from front to back. I'll do two of them. And then one in the front 
uh, above the workbench. And what else did I get? Crap, nuts, bolts, paint. These things add up. I mean, I've got so much, so, so much crap and fab and stuff. And uh, I've got a lot of free stuff. I've got a lot of people from businesses, my friends that work at companies that tell them what I'm doing and that I could use some drywall, or not drywall, um, stuff to frame it up in the plywood like I got last year from my buddy's work. His company hooked me up. But um, I've had a lot of people hook me up, actually. A lot of my friends have hooked me up. Um, I wouldn't be where I'm at without any of them, and I'm thankful for that. There's a lot of people offering to help that I know will help me when I need them. Um, but I've really been getting it going lately, and I'm feeling really good about it. It's, it's, it's kind of starting to take off for me because I got this March 16th trip with my daughter down to Ocala. It's like a horse farm type place. It's really nice, um, for like, uh, her trainers and them have always gone there. My daughter's always wanted to go. So I'm going to drive her down there and I'm taking my ex-wife. I've left that out on all this, but she's paying for the fuel. <laughs> she said she offered it. She's like, Hey, if I pay you, you know, for the fuel to go down there and back, will you tow the trailer so she can get her stuff down there, which led into me buying a trailer. Cause I don't want to tow her friend's trailer, but it's going to be my first long trip with the bus. I'm excited. I've got a lot of stuff to do though. And I swear this gabapentin, it does things that clouds me on like, like the GoPro, the GoPro I can't figure out. I got clustered with it. So I quit. Um, what else was I just thinking about earlier that I got to do? It just gets me like that. When I run into a problem, oh, like when I run into a problem on something, I'll just go the other way and do something else and leave it knowing I got to figure it out. And it's probably something dumb and I can do it. But I know that's, it. it's just stupid medication. I've got to get off of it. I just got to get something else that I can take that will help with the phantom pains because they're awful. I just, they're awful. Even taking the medicine, I get them constantly, but it really does tone it down a bit. But, um, yes, I've got, what else was I going to say? See, now I'm talking about it and it gets me clouded. <laughs> but, nope, that's what I got going on. I uh, showed out this weekend. Candace came over Friday night and spent the night, and it was so much fun. We just hung out. She watched, we watched Grey's Anatomy, and I actually get into it sitting there with her watching it, and she makes fun of me. But what else is there? Uh, gosh, I know there was something else I was going to say. You get all these ideas you want to say stuff to make a video. It comes to it. Oh, and that stupid thing there. You got to watch. I crash these chairs all the time. All my friends make fun of me. Keep a joysticks on them. They're so damn close. When you're sitting there watching TV and you hit it a little bit or a lot and get going wide open across your living room and don't wake up until impact, it tends to leave uh, scars. <laughs> and I've had lots of them. I've had them slid sl from tip of my nose up. Blood skinned it. I've done it so many times. I mean, this is getting, a, this is a normal thing. It goes up pretty quick, though. <laughs> but. Yes, I'm excited. I gotta get that spare tire mount on. I gotta get the other two rims off the trailer. I'm gonna set it up on jack stands where it's at. Hopefully I can. It's kind of in the front of the shop on an angle on the hill part, but I gotta get those other two rims off so I can paint them red. Uh, once I put the the uh, beauty rings and center caps on, um, I'm hoping, because I didn't get crazy with the edge here, as you can see, but the, be the beauty rings should clip on here, and I'm hoping they should clip on here. I know you don't see that, and what you do see from behind will be gray, and the chrome will be up to it, and you won't notice the red, which will look dumb. And I didn't want to go through and card all this or tape it or do all that bull crap. But, um, so I just did the best I could and got as close as I could to where hopefully the beauty ring goes into at least here. And I got this here all the way around really good on this one. And... The back side, not so much. I didn't card it or anything. I just got as close as I could. Two coats. Um, it's called Banner Red. I was trying to get something that matched my YouTube sticker because I'm getting a 2x2 two two red YouTube uh, app sticker or, you know, thing made to put on the side of the trailer on each side. And I'm going to put a Todd pen really big so people can see it. Um... People can talk crap all they want, but I'm just, that's what I want to be doing. That's what I'm doing. So if you don't like it, too bad. Don't watch my shit. Well, you know, I can't stand people that complain behind my back. 
and get to me, but um, that's all I got, guys. It's the beginning of a, another week, a work week, a five-day work week for most people. That's good. <laughs> I hope you guys have a good one. Um, don't get in no trouble. Work hard. Don't be stealing. <laughs> be good. Peace.